what's our plan today in Riverside? Well, I can tell you what I'm not gonna do, and that is not gonna do all the work myself. Bo's actually gonna do the work, mm. because doing the work part of this job sucks. Packed in trash bags, just the way we like it. All right, let's do this thing and make it happen. If you're ready to go, I'm ready to go. Now, 100 bucks? Two. I got no, 200 bucks. What about two and a half? What about two and a half? Right then, a three. I got three. two and a half. Number three, three there. You better do. He's bidding. 315. How about that? What about two and a half? Number four now. 350. 400 bucks. 400 going once. 400 going twice. Gotta go get squad and I. So much way. $350. Garrett. Uh, Bozak did all the heavy lifting. Now it's time for the brains of the operation. Found a little screen printer. Put that up there and then pull the trash out right here because Brandy's making a freaking mess. This is interesting. It's a silk screening machine, but it doesn't look like any that I've seen before. Are those blank skateboard decks? Yeah. Is know. there only three? Is there more yeah, of these? There's only three. So what can you get for those? I don't know. I don't even know where you get blank skateboard decks. If that's for printing skateboards, that is going to be legit. We're at Pocket Pistols to meet with a guy named Chicken. So, uh... Chicken, huh? Is it high school? I had red mohawk and a bit of a beak, so ended up with chicken. I feel like it should be rooster. At first, I thought it was just a regular, like, silk screen for t-shirts. Yeah. But I couldn't figure out where you put the t-shirt. Yeah, no, it's made for boards. These are made for the truck holes, you know, so it holds the oh, skateboard yeah. in place. This machine is kind of more like a at-home kind of hobby user. Obviously, you don't like this machine very much, but... Yeah, it's not my favorite but it's gotta have some kind of value. Yeah, definitely there's some value to it. I mean, you know, it's gotta be worth, I don't know, maybe 350. Huh. Brandy may see this as a loss, but I see it as an opportunity. And if you'd like to buy an outlaw skateboard, call the number below. And for three easy payments of 1995, you too could have a piece of the outlaw apparel kingdom. I may not have a lot of friends, but I got a lot of money. King of the world! <laughs>